Rishi Sunak, 60,399. Liz Truss, 81,326. Therefore, I give notice that Liz Truss is elected as the leader of the Conservative and Unionist Party. We'll come up on the Sir Graham, it's an honour to be elected as leader of the Conservative and Unionist Party. I'd like to thank the 1922 Committee, the Party Chairman and the Conservative Party for organising one of the longest job interviews in history. Thank you very much. I'd also like to thank my family, my friends, my political colleagues and all of those who helped on this campaign. I'm incredibly grateful for all of your support. I'd like to pay tribute to my fellow candidates, particularly Rishi Sunak. It's been a hard-fought campaign. I think we have shown the depth and breadth of talent in our Conservative Party. I want to thank our outgoing leader, my friend, Boris Johnson. <laughs> Boris, you got Brexit done. You crushed Jeremy Corbyn. You rolled out the vaccine and you stood up to Vladimir Putin. You were admired from Kiev to Carlisle. and colleagues, thank you for putting your faith in me to lead our great Conservative Party, the greatest political party on earth. I know, I know that our beliefs resonate with the British people. Our beliefs in freedom, in the ability to control your own life, in low taxes, in personal responsibility. And I know that's why people voted for us in such numbers in 2019. And as your party leader, I intend to deliver what we promised those voters right across our great country. During this leadership campaign, I campaigned as a Conservative and I will govern as a Conservative. And my friends, we need to show that we will deliver over the next two years. I will deliver a bold plan to cut taxes and grow our economy. I will deliver on the energy crisis, dealing with people's energy bills, but also dealing with the long-term issues we have on energy supply. Yeah. 